Carcinoma of the testes is another important carcinoma, which is the leading cause of the death in men worldwide. It constitutes about 1 to 1.5% of all the, all the tumors which are found in the men. Today in this lecture, we'll be talking about the carcinoma of the testes. First, we'll be discussing about a little bit about the anatomy of the testes, and then we'll be talking about, uh, most importantly, and most primarily about the classification of the testicular tumors, which is very much important entity to know. Uh, the testicular tumors are divided into seminomas and non-seminomas, so we will be talking about the seminomas, which are almost the 90 to 95 percent of the testicular tumors, and then obviously we'll be talking about the non-seminomas as well, which are compromising about 5 to 7 percent of all the testicular tumors. Uh, particularly in this lecture, obviously we'll be discussing about the clinical features, how a patient is typically presenting to you, uh, particularly like uh, swelling, a painless lump, and obviously the tumor metastasis is also important thing to be discussed in today's lecture. The tumor metastasis also actually governs the type of the clinical features if the tumor is not metastatic. So we'll be uh, discussing about the clinical features like if the tumor is not metastatic, how the patient is going to present to you. If the tumor has developed metastasis, then how the patient would be typically presenting to you. Then we'll be talking about a typical important uh, steps in the clinical history you need to ask from the patient. We'll be discussing today about the steps of the physical examination, the findings, the important investigations which are uh, need to be uh, performed in the, in, in the case of a testicular tumor, how you are going to differentiate um, a testicular swelling, like the torsion of the testes, injury to the testes, a testicular hematoma from that of a testicular tumor. Then particularly in today's lecture, we'll be talking about the different biomarkers which are specific to the kind of the tumors like the alpha fetoprotein, specific to the yolk sac tumor and beta HCG uh, specific to the choreo carcinomas. Uh, another important thing uh, which will be discussed in today's lecture is about the TNM staging which is very much important because you need to stage the tumor in order uh, to um, you know uh, just uh, decide about the treatment uh, strategy for the patient. Uh, we would be discussing about uh, the stages and obviously the stage dependent treatment we'll be discussing about the surgical options we have available in case of the testicular tumors and the type of the radiotherapy and the chemotherapy and then at the end we'll be discussing about the prognosis of the testicular tumors because uh, these are uh, particularly the interstitial tumors they have a good prognosis we'll be discussing about that the other tumors like the grade 4 tumors those have been metastasized by the time they have been discovered they have been discovered so uh, in uh, today's lecture we'll be discussing about all those uh, all there are thousands of the medical lectures which are found on our website which is cardia.com it is a kind of the online tutorial and you can always get access to our website you can uh, go get there um, uh, any type of lecture regarding anatomy biochemistry physiology uh, urology general surgery all kind of the subjects are available on our set on our website which is cardia.com so this was the trailer for today's lecture for the detailed lecture keep watching cardia.com thank you for watching